Time is money, and here at IMSI Design, we understand that. In every new version of TurboCAD, we add new features, improve existing tools, and optimize our code base to deliver a more efficient product. TurboCAD 20 is no exception, as we have not only continued to improve productivity, but are also offering new ways and new tools to deliver your designs and create models that may have been impossible to do in previous versions. Selecting objects is one of the most important tasks in TurboCAD. We have added three new drag modes for a total of four. In addition, we have also added an option to restore your previously used selection. This super selector can also be used in other operations, such as 3D add or subtract. The ability to select multiple objects in a variety of ways during different operations will greatly improve the productivity of these already powerful tools. In TurboCAD 20, we have added two new two-dimensional drawing tools, the Gear Contour and Stellated Polygon. While shapes like these could be drawn in past versions of TurboCAD, these new tools draw parametric objects which can be changed after they have been drawn. The Stellated Polygon has a wave option and both can be extruded with a center hole automatically created. In addition, the Gear Contour has a pinion option to fit a second gear into place. Associative dimensioning in viewports allows dimensions inserted into paper space to update when changes are made to objects in model space. In TurboCAD 20, we have expanded this so dimensions of 2D objects, solids, and surfaces remain associative in standard views. We have added a reference point to drafting objects. This gives users greater control over how views and sections are updated when changes are made to 3D objects. Presentation is an important part of the design cycle, and making sure your 3D models look correct when rendered is essential. Using bitmapped images for 3D textures in TurboCAD has always been a bit tricky. Now in version 20, we have added the ability to map images directly onto the faces of your 3D models. UV mapping makes using images simple and effective, giving you the exact control you need over using these images for textures of your 3D models. Sending designs in a format others can view is an important part of any project. In TurboCAD 20, we have added 3D PDF to our already strong variety of export options. Exporting to 3D PDF automatically embeds your 3D model into a PDF document that can be fully examined using Adobe Acrobat Reader. Creating smooth and organic objects was not always an easy task in TurboCAD. On version 19, we added Smesh objects. In version 20, we have expanded on this and added two new tools, Extrude Face and Split Face. Split Face allows you to split a single face into two. Extrude Face allows you to pull a face along a path created with a curve or polyline. These two new Smesh tools will greatly enhance your ability to create smooth and organic models. Creating technical drawings of mechanical parts is an important task for any CAD application. In the Platinum Edition of TurboCAD 20, we continue to improve on this by dramatically expanding the flexibility of the pattern tools. The pattern tools can now be used with all 2D objects. 2D patterns can be used as compound profiles that can be extruded into 3D objects with the patterns remaining associative. Patterns created with points can be used with the whole tool. Levels have been added to pattern on a polyline, pattern on a curve, and radial patterns. In addition, we have added rings to the radial patterns. With the additional function of these pattern tools, users will be able to quickly create features on 3D models that can be easily edited via the part tree when changes need to be made. Business Information Modeling, or BIM, is a process that includes delivering information with your drawing to assist the building of a project. 
In TurboCAD 20, we have added entity markers as another step in this direction. Entity markers allow you to create property set definitions in multi-view blocks. Property set definitions allow you to create custom information for objects, such as the style, cost, and dimensions of windows. That information can be used to generate a report, such as a bill of materials. Multi-view blocks allow you to find composites of blocks that can vary in their appearance depending on view. So there you have it. New ways to deliver your designs, new object types, and as always an overall more productive and efficient precision design software product. And if you're still not sold, please visit TurboCAD.com for more information and to access a free trial download of TurboCAD Professional 20.